Britt McHenry, who got the boot from ESPN along with 99 other employees in a corporate downsizing, claims she was fired because she was a martyr to the conservative cause. Alex Brandon AP, New York Daily News Tuesday, November 14, 2017, 4.02 p.m. Britt McHenry, a right-wing sports reporter and infamous hater of everyday working people, used and abused the honor bestowed upon Colin Kaepernick, a true heroic modern-day civil rights fighter, by pulling a publicity stunt, which may solidify her chances of a permanent gig on Fox News. And hey, what woman wouldn't want to solidify her creds as a hater while shaming herself publicly? which in turn could lead to a permanent contributor gig at Fox News, the network that has shamed women for decades. For her latest publicity stunt, McHenry lashed out at GQ magazine for naming Kaepernick Citizen of the Year for taking a knee. Wear socks depicting police officers as pigs, wear Fidel Castro as a fashion statement in Miami, sue NFL for collusion when GF compares owners to slave owners, win Citizen of the Year serve in the U.S. military, nothing. What a joke, GQ. Hashtag Kaepernick, she tweeted. Britt McHenry, it's a joke GQ honored Colin Kaepernick this from a woman who was suspended from ESPN two years ago for treating people working in a garage like trash, making fun of the female attendant's teeth, weight, education and saying she's better than the clerk because, I'm in the news, sweetheart. Worse. That's why I have a degree and you don't. And, it makes my skin crawl to even be in here. Colin Kaepernick, right, and Eric Reed kneel during the national anthem before an NFL football game against the Carolina Panthers in Charlotte, North Carolina, in 2016. Mike McCarn AP, Colin Kaepernick, Gal Gadot among GQ's People of the Year Yeah. We can't wait to take our civil rights opinions from the whitest woman on the planet instead of taking a hint from a man who knows both sides because he came from a mixed-race family and was willing to put his career on the line to protest police brutality against black people. We can't wait to have a laid-off sidelines reporter decide who GQ should and should not declare Citizen of the Year. McHenry added to the first tweet. J.J. Watt raised $37 million for Hurricane Harvey victims. $37 million. But Kaepernick refused to stand for our national anthem, a year ago, and is Citizen of the Year. Right. Meantime, in September, Kaepernick was honored by the NFL Players Association as community MVP for his commitment to empowering underserved communities through hundreds of thousands of dollars in donations and his grassroots outreach. Britt McHenry wants NFL to apologize to Vegas cops in case you forgot, or never bothered to know such nonsense. Earlier this year, McHenry got the boot from ESPN along with 99 other employees in a corporate downsizing. ESPN reporter Britt McHenry was suspended for one week following the release of security camera footage showing the blonde beauty unleashing a barrage of insults and mocking the attendant's job education and her physical appearance after her car was towed earlier this month in Arlington, Virginia. Live Lake, but McHenry, in a breathtaking bit of egomania decided she got fired not because she'd embarrassed the network or wasn't good, but because she was a martyr to the conservative cause. What about the 99 other fired folks, presumably people of every political stripe, who also lost their jobs? Oh? Right, they are just working stiffs whom she despises for not being as important as she. If you want to talk about martyrdom in sports, maybe she should start with Colin Kaepernick himself, a man who put it all on the line, in part because he took a knee instead of bowing to pressure. What would she have said about Jackie Robinson when he first stepped onto the field or to Muhammad Ali when he protested the draft? or when John Carlos and Tommy Smith gave the Black Power salute at the 1968 Summer Olympics, when Sean Green refused to play baseball on Yom Kippur, when the Phoenix Suns protested Arizona's anti-immigration law by wearing lost Suns jerseys. Colin Kaepernick became the symbol of a stand-up guy by kneeling down to live his truth. He lost his job. McHenry is trying to become the symbol of white concern.